I'm not gonna lie, I know this is crazy to say, but this is extremely therapeutic for me. It's great that I have control over the situation and I get to create a healthy environment for my employees. I'm not gonna tell yo this again. Hurry it up before I promote yo this to customer. Come on! ETH, coming to you live. All the way from the south side. Shout out my CEOs, all my small business owners. We see these people struggling, but we don't give a damn. It's just business though. Yeah. Let me go ahead and tell you all about inflation. Complain about the prices, bitch, while I'm on a vacation. I know you see them prices, man, but please do not start hating. Like a pig at Sunday breakfast, bitch, I'm all about it, baby. You staring at them numbers and you looking kind of sad. But I know that you hungry, so my prices ain't that bad. So come to the supermarket, put them groceries in a bag. Get the fuck out by my store and let me count up all this cash. What you gonna do about it? Nothing. What I think about inflation? I love it. I think somebody in the government can stop it, but they should change it. Put money in my pockets. Great prices, but I tell these folks, knowing them well is lies and jokes. Don't come in if you're loud and broke, cause the beat gon' drop, but the prices won't go. Welcome back to some more Supermarket Simulator. I have been highly requested to bring another episode of this back from y'all. Y'all showed so much love on the previous video. I can't thank you guys enough. I didn't even know you guys would like it, but here we are again. And boy, have I got some surprises for you. I have been playing off camera. I've been fucking grinding. I didn't even know Supermarket Simulator could be this much of a grind, but we're doing it. So without further ado, let's start the show. You know what I'm saying? Y'all see it, right? As you can see from the very start, you can, you see we got a new sign up you know we got a big ass market sign what the f bitch do you not see me trying to show off my fucking store you're just gonna run over a pedestrian like that Nigga, hey get out the damn car get out the car before i snatch you at that motherfucker homie anyway here we have uh our big ass supermarket sign we upgraded from the tiny one that we had now let me show you inside <laughs> Remember when I told y'all last episode that everything was all about expansion? It's all about expansion. Look at our store. Our tiny store turned into something else, bro. We got some more space. We expanded the space and we have an employee. Uh, his name is Enrique. Everybody say hi, Enrique. And I forgot to mention, look at these outrageous prices. <laughs> Look at these outrageous prices out here, bro. I'm price gouging in this bitch. I told y'all, bro. I didn't wrap that whole shit for nothing. Inflation. <laughs> it's a bitch, ain't it? We got $10 for cereal, $7.50 for some fucking bread, and we got $13 for some tea and five for some salt. Nigga, this, you know what the average price of this shit is? 94 cents. <laughs> I'm price gouging the fuck out of everybody, bro. It'd be, I, I really want to see, I, I know for a fact they're going to complain about the high prices, but I just want to see if people are going to actually come in and buy it. So let's open up shop. Here we go. Great, Great prices, prices, everyone. Great, Great prices. prices. Everything new on the shelves. We've expanded our stores. So you have more options to choose from. Great prices. Miss Lady. Lady. Why am I yelling at her, bro? She's minding her own business. How you doing, sir? Welcome to supermarket. Please come in, come in with all your money, bro. With all your money. Enrique, you better make this shit quick, all right? I know it's your first day on the job. We need we need speedy fucking service, bro. We need speedy service, all right? Thank you very much. Look at that shit. They already complaining about the damn oil, bro. I'm just I'm just trying to what I'm trying to do today is what the ma'am, you are not supposed to be walking behind the fucking count register like that. Don't do that shit again. What I'm trying to do right now is just empty out all of the stock that I have for today. Um, I don't know if it's going to take me like a day or two to fi do this shit, but it might. I'm not sure because niggas are going to You see. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy. It's too expensive, but inflation, you got to You got to pay the price. You got to pay the price, bro. Everybody is just mad at the at the prices, bro. Like I can't. I don't know what to tell you. You better pick that shit up right now. See, she got bread. She is not worried about a damn thing, bro. She getting all that damn cereal, that $10 cereal. Who the fuck is paying $10 cereal in real life, bro? Great prices. Get your ass in here. Let's go. Okay, y'all. I don't know how I can get more customers in here. I priced so many. 
bro i priced shit so high it's not even funny i don't even think i'm going to get my product out bro i really don't think so i really don't think so but we're, we're gonna see we're gonna see okay new plan bro because everybody that's coming in here is complaining about the prices you already know <laughs> all right let me stop fucking playing bro i'm going to go ahead and actually put this at reasonable prices because <laughs> They are really complaining about the shit. Okay, um, I, I'm not, I'm not touching that bread actually, bro. We're gonna go ahead and price this at five. Yeah, niggas are really complaining, bro. They are really complaining. Okay, I went ahead and changed all the prices given the fact that niggas are complaining. So, um, I'm not price gouging anymore. I'm gonna wait until I clear out everything and then we're gonna restock and do all that shit. So, give me like five seconds. Okay, y'all. So, I restocked. I bought some more product and we did change all of our items back to where I, it was. I thought I was gonna get away with a little bit more price gouging, but they proved me wrong. So, they was complaining to, they was complaining about all of my products in here. So, we got the, look at this bullshit again. I'm gonna find his ass. I promise you I will. So, we're gonna go ahead ahead and restock all of this shit because there's a lot of people that came in here and was disappointed that i didn't have a certain product um i have orange juice right i'm not bro i'm not changing the prices on certain items because i think niggas are just being cheap and i need to make a profit so we'll see how many people complain today all right i finished restocking everything should be at a reasonable price and everything should be good okay so here we go we, we are open, open new and improved prices because you niggas was complaining you there come spend all your money here at the supermarket right okay you, bro it's the only supermarket in the in the in the neighborhood bro so you might as well just do it i we got premium products everything in this bitch is organic okay you see <laughs> You want me to change the price? God damn. Oh, you know what? That is that, that is very unreasonable. I'll, I'll give her that. I think what we're going to do here is we're going to save enough money to get that storage open, bro. Because I need that. And I need. I also need another fridge. Oh, I didn't, forgot to tell you. I bought a fridge and shit. There's a lot of new stuff that I bought. But today, we're just, we're just focused on products being sold off, okay? I'm not about to have these people complain about shit that is too expensive. So while that's going on... Enrique! Do not make my line long do you hear me all right you can take your five after give me a couple more sales everybody is they keep complaining about the cheese dude what if i just hear it's a, it's a it's unreasonable let me see let me see if it's unreasonable okay it is unreasonable let's drop that down to 350 then and then the orange juice, we'll drop that down to $3. How about that? Enrique, what did I tell you about the line, bro? Look at look at how slow this motherfucker is going. I need to open up another register in this bitch, bro. You costing me money, dog. I think I need to open up another register. Anybody want to come over here to the supermarket? You look fancy as hell, bro. I know you have bread. Get up in my store and spend money. Borlat milk? What? Nigga, it's full. You know what? That is very unreasonable. Okay, okay. No, no, no. We got it. We got it. Eggs is too. No, I'm not. I'm not changing the prices off the eggs. You got me messed up. You go get yourself. Get your shit and go. Yeah. Bye. Oh, you 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 bought some. Okay. Let's go, people. Let's go. Enrique, listen to what the fuck I'm telling you. All right. Enrique, you are moving too damn slow in this bitch. All right. Look at her. You're making her very uncomfortable with your slow ass performance. All right. Stop doing this shit. You're making the customers extremely uncomfortable. All right. They don't like seeing slow customer service. Do you hear me? Look at me when I'm talking to you, Enrique. <laughs> you kind of swimming, bro. What the f***? The Borlate milk is still expensive for y'all. I'm not going to lie. If you can't afford it, please leave. Ma'am, you are not supposed to be walking through this aisle. I got miscellaneous product here. What the? Are niggas like, do niggas not respect me? Did I not just say not to walk behind the register? Attention customers, do not walk behind the register, all right? I don't know if y'all trying to steal the money from the register, but if you do, we gonna catch a fade in this bitch. Has anybody touched the flower yet? No, it seems like nobody, actually no, it has. People are, people are buying flower. Okay, the checkouts are full. I know it's because Enrique, en Enrique really, this nigga really moving like a sloth on Xanax, bro. All right, I, I ma'am, guys, I am so sorry for the wait, y'all. I know Enrique is new. Just get cutting some slack. I'll talk to him when he when, when we close the shop. I'm not gonna give you. Listen, I'm not gonna tell your ass again. Hurry it up before I promote your ass to customer. Pretend I'm not here. I know damn well you hear what the fuck I just said, Enrique. I'm not playing with you today. Family friend recommended you to me. I'm, I don't want to hear shit. Do not let them down, bro. All right, this is this is a business. What you gonna do if I expand, bro? You gonna make the lines out the door? 
Huh? I'm talking to you. I think he got the memo, y'all. I think everything is good, okay? All right. Nobody is messing with the flower, bro. Yeah, nobody is messing with that flower. So we're gonna go ahead and change it to about maybe $3. So I think on the next day, I think we should be good. I think we should all be good. I'm gonna restock a little bit more and then we are going to wait for the next day. This day, oh my God, the comato cheese and the craft went up. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. I didn't see that. Hold on, what went up? What went up and what went down? Let's look at the market here. Okay, so now this is 68 cents and oh shit all right no i'm gonna leave that there i'm gonna leave that there i think what i'm gonna do here is i want to buy i really want to buy another shelf but i'm gonna wait bro i'm gonna wait until i buy another shelf i'm gonna wait till i get a little bit more cash and then we're gonna buy another shelf i think the goal here today is to get storage and then start hiring people uh start hiring restockers oh my god that's a lot more money bro i'm not gonna lie to you um and then i'm gonna expand a little bit more bro but the next expansion is gonna be 2600 bills yo this is we're moving up but it's costing Fuck. all right i want to see i want to see shit i want to see she shit fly bro i want to see shit fly off the, the shelves because we're not making enough money to have these prices bro i'm not gonna lie but i need to I'm, i need to make a profit like i i can't sit here and cater to my customers like that bro are people still not buying the flower or what because I, I still see it un untouched are y'all still not happy what more do you want from me who's gonna complain about the flower i want to see it okay you gonna pay six dollars for some sugar but y'all niggas want to complain about three dollars worth of flour? I don't see I don't see that shit happening in any lifetime, and it's definitely not gonna happen in mine. Y'all gonna pay that three dollars on on off on, on God, y'all are. Enrique, what is this customer service? I'm going to open up another register on that ass. I'm gonna I want to see how much I make today. I want to see how much I make today, bro. Are, are people like, what's going on? Come to this store right now with that Montclair on. I know you have money. Yes, people are still not buying the flour, y'all. You know what? I'm just gonna bite the bullet here and I'm gonna I'm gonna knock that bitch down. I'm gonna keep knocking it down until they until they buy it, bro. I'm about to make two bands and then we're going to restock and buy more shelves. I think that's the idea here. We're gonna restock and buy more shelves. The more items I have, the more uh the more guap I attain. Isn't that how it works? It better be how it works. See, look, finally, bro. Hey, I appreciate your business. Matter of fact, I'm gonna put that bitch to 250. <laughs> Because two dollars. See, I just wanted to get somebody to at least buy it. We made a little bit over fifteen hundred. Not what the fuck, nigga. Get that. What did I tell y'all about walking behind the register? Yo, I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. Hey, if you press me like that again, it's gonna be a problem, bro. You gonna put that bag down? We gonna catch a fucking fade. You already balling, bro. So I know you're miserable. It's looking good. I'm gonna keep the doors open for a little bit longer, and then we gonna see, bro. I'm gonna open up another register. I really am. I'm gonna open up another register, and then I'm gonna get more shelves. Oh, let me see some. Yeah, we gonna open up another register in this bitch because I love Enrique, but he's he's going real slow for me. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, now I have more products and I also have another counter. So we're gonna go ahead and open this bitch right here. And we're gonna put this bitch right here. So I'm looking at this nigga while he is working. So I have more product. I went ahead and look at, where is he, bro? I, I need, need to, to see him. him. Oh, Jamel, it's not a big deal. You wild out for no reason, nigga. It is a big deal for me. People gonna see this and gonna be like, bro, he getting bitched out here. Like why, why, why would I shop here? No, bro, I'm not having that i'm not gonna lie i know this is crazy to say but this is extremely therapeutic for me it's great that i have control over the situation and i get to create a healthy environment for my employees <laughs> all right listen we're not gonna start that shit today all right today i'm feeling very petty so if you give me a bill for like two items nigga i will give you it i'll, I'll give it to you all in pennies think i'm playing damn all right, bro, $81 is your total? Who the f you think you are, big baller? All right, couldn't find honeybee cereal. Oh shit, did I not stock that? Enrique, how the hell did I already finish two customers and you still with the same two that walked through the door before I got to this register? I am not playing with you, Enrique. I hired you for a reason. Don't look at me, don't give me that back talk. Who the hell are you talking back to? I'm your boss, nigga. Hey, matter of fact, take your 10, take your 10. Take your 10, bro. You think I'm playing with you. You think this shit is a game. $76 is your total. Oh my God. Thank you for your business, bro. I appreciate it. Okay, here we go. I just finished another, bro. I know you're not. So let me take this money and look at my register and that bitch says $100. You're a lucky bastard. I was about to give you the fucking work. How you doing, ma'am? How you doing? Oh, thank you. It's a lovely day we're having today at supermarket. Okay. Oh, you give me exact change? Thank you so much, sir. Have a great day. I mean, ma'am. I am so sorry. Yo, everybody is spending bands. I like this. I like this a lot. $49 is and 75 cents is your total. Thank you very much coming in. You couldn't find basmati rice. Enrique, you're doing well, bro. I appreciate that. I appreciate you working under uh, these pressured conditions. I really appreciate it. Enrique, I know damn well I don't see a line. You know what? Let me let me open the checkout. I want to expand a lot more here, but I don't know if I'm going to do it on this gameplay, bro. I'm, I'm, 
I think I don't know. I'm not sure. Listen, I'm gonna be very honest here. I think I'm not sure if I'm doing this pricing shit right because I'm spending a lot more than I'm gaining. I'm gonna be real. I'm trying to see if there's a sweet spot in terms of pricing, and I'm coming up short. So I think what I what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna put everything up in 50 cent increments okay i'm gonna mark everything up in 50 cent increments so like next day we'll do another 50 on everything another day we'll do 50 and we're just gonna keep going all right so finally somebody is taking the damn bread excuse me don't rush me bitch um your total is going to be three thirty three dollars damn 33 dollars all right get the fuck out by my store total is 26 dollars and 80 cents madam all right thank you for coming have a great day $17 twin so your total is going to be $2.50 all right now I um hold on wait a minute oh my god she is balling out thank you for your business $64 is your change change nigga your price I ain't giving no money out okay ain't nobody touching the damn pizza I I'm assuming so maybe that means that the price is unreasonable okay that's fine I'll take care of that right fucking now we're gonna go six dollars with this shit Okay, boom, that should be good enough. I'm going to buy another freezer because I need a lot more, uh, hold on a second. Hold on, sir, give me a second. Put the damn box down, the fuck? Oh my God, all right. Sorry, sorry about the wait, sir. I am so sorry, I had a mental breakdown. <laughs> no worries, the service is nothing but premiere. Okay, uh, $4, one, two, three, four. I don't know if I gave him the right change. I wasn't looking, okay, it's cool. 17 have a great day oh my god it's a fiend i haven't seen one of y'all in a long ass time everybody just ignore the fiend in my store okay she's it's all right just ignore it everybody i have enough product to like you know get me at least to like 500 i don't need to buy any more product 20 40, 60, 80 it's just that <laughs> my shit is unreasonable so that's why it's not coming off the shelf as quick i remember back in the day when we first opened shits just started flying off of the shelf and that was because my price Oh my, it's a fiend party! Oh my, it's a whole fiend meetup in my store, bitch! What the, what the hell is going on? Oh my god, bro, that's money right there. Oh, that's money right there, and they just sitting there pacing back and forth. I don't know if I'm gonna make enough to uh, get storage here. I'll be real. I need to make enough profit to at least... Yo, can you put in the correct number? Oh my god, you bought one stick of butter? Let me find out that's a hundred dollars in your hand. I swear to god, bro, you're gonna be real. Okay. A lot of people, a lot of people learned their lesson, bro, with the threats that I was making. 25, 35, 45. All right. Okay, so today we made a profit of five hundred dollars. It's not bad. I think I don't know if, what I need to do. If I should buy storage, another fridge. We might buy storage in the next episode if y'all are if y'all wanted me to continue this. We starting off with that bullshit already, huh? All right, lady. Oh, oh, so that's what she was looking for. Okay. Okay, y'all, as you can see here, we are on the next day and um, here we go. So we have more product and I bought another shelf. I am completely out of fucking money, bro. <laughs> I can't do shit with that little last $29, bro. But here we go. We are going to, it's all about expansion, bro. It don't matter. I'm gonna make my shit is gonna make money. Let's open up shop. I'm expecting big bands today. All right. You know, you wanna know why? Because expansion. Expansion. We got more shelves now. You know what? I'm gonna put these bitches on sale because nobody is seeming to grab them. I need this out. I need this gone by tonight. Okay. So we got more. We got new products and shit. I don't. What else do I have? I, I have all these. I think I overspent. I won't lie to y'all. I also heard that they're going to implement shoplifters at some point, and I cannot wait for that shit. Depending on how you know this series does. I might continue it to where we can see shoplifters and chase them down. That'll be kind of fun. Let me know what y'all think. All y'all have to do is uh click that like button. She's been here for a while. Um, I think she's about to get a lot of shit right now. Okay, $18. All right. Bitch, I'm giving her $10. No, you you don't get $10. You get 75 cents. I'm sorry, I'm just a little bit off of my rocker. All right. I had a lot to drink last night. I'm sorry. I was about to I was about to rob my damn self. The fuck? No! She's a fiend now! No! She was about to spend so much money. Please, please don't do this to me. No! Please! 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 Please pick up something. Please pick up something else. Oh my god. No. She's a fiend. No. No, no, please. This is some ridiculous ass shit right now, bro. She was in here for a while. She was about to spend a bag on me, dog. Oh my god, bro. I'm a little bit annoyed with that. So what happens to my product? Does that mean they take the shit? Because they took shit off my shelves. So what what does that mean? Are they gonna is it gonna spawn back? Because if it doesn't, they just stole some shit. They're shoplifters in a sense. Oh shit, did the power go out? I forgot to pay the bill. Shit, shit, wait. 
Oh, okay, my bad. Go ahead and take your 15, all right? Before you clock out for you, you ain't getting overtime, bitch. You ain't getting no overtime. I don't do that here. Anyway, oh my god! I forgot to price these bitches. Oh, you are not no fucking way, bro. I forgot to price the f out of these bitches right here. And she's about to get them for free. Okay, no, no, she's not. She's just getting it off of, uh, Mark. You're lucky. You're very lucky, bro. That honey is expensive. I totally forgot to price them. Hold on. I forgot to price all these new items and shit. Okay, guys, I think I'm gonna wrap it up here. As you can see, we made a pretty good amount of guap today. Listen, Enrique, I'm sorry I've been yelling at you throughout the entirety of your career here. Um, you are and still will always be one of my elite employees. But I'm your only employee. Shut, sh shut the f- You know what I meant. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, please- Break that like button, comment, subscribe, join the human crew today. Listen, y'all have been showing so much love to this series. I genuinely did not think it would do that well on the first go around. But if y'all want me to continue, just let me know. All you got to do is break that like button, bro. And I'll, that'll be confirmation for me that you guys want some more. All right. I love you guys. Stay blessed. Stay positive. Drink lots of water. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Signing out. Peace. <laughs>